very much, Shaq, for uh, being the first ones on the field today. Um, I'm going to start with Shaq. Uh, Shaq, you're um, dealt with a little bit distracted at the start, um, but I look at it um, because I have to look at it as a judge. Dog is a little bit reactive, and this is a test uh, for us to see if the dog is reactive to other animals, is it reactive to other dogs, so we need to take, keep that in consideration. So what does the obedience routine do? It will show us these things. So when you come up with two dogs, the dog might be a bit reactive, but then when you go into the obedience routine, the dog has another chance. Yeah, you're on lead, so you have the dog under control, but then you show through the routine that the dog is actually under control, and then it's not distracted any, anymore. We're not done yet with testing that part of the dog because we still have a traffic test to go. Um, but for the obedience routine, he worked through it in a good manner. Thank you. So I would like to start with uh, healing on leash. I would like to see a little bit more control at the basic position. And then with the build up, the dog is uh, uh, listening to you, comes with you, but then there's a little bit of a low intensity. Yep. It's like, it's just under control. Yep. We would like to see a little bit more teamwork with a little bit more spirit okay. into the dog. Yep. Um, but the dog continues through the whole routine. Then when you come to the left about turn, uh, for future reference, I would like to do a left about the turn. That's a turn on the spot and not a walk around that you walk around. Okay. And we call that usually a U-turn. So okay, yep. try to improve that where you're gonna go, you're in the same line and you turn back okay. exactly okay. from where you come from. Yeah, so uh, you did that twice because we got two times this turn. Um, don't stop on the corners, yeah, don't stand still. The same when um, in the pre healing, you did it as well. When you after the left about turn, yeah, you were a, bit, a little bit lost, so I helped you out, yeah. but not a problem. And then in the group, the dog was across the whole healing in the same uh, behavior. We'll see if we can improve that in the future. Then the automatic sit was not quite there, you had to help him with the command, and then it was slow. very similar picture at the basic position I'll give you a little bit of help a little bit of instruction and then um, the dog I would like to see um, a bit more intensity a bit more teamwork with the two of you um, but the dog stays under control um, then when we after the left about turn um, you stop a little bit I'm sorry keep moving keep moving and then um, you need to keep in mind the pace change so we got normal heel we got into a fast heel, then we go into a slow heel, and then we go back to normal. Yeah, but you switch that a little bit, it was a bit all over the place. We would like to see a bit bigger difference between the, the pace changes. Yeah, um, and also use your command when you change the pace. Um, but all in all, a satisfactory exercise. Sit in motion, build up is the same thing. Oh, sorry, the, the basic position and the build up is the same thing, and even little bit slower you're almost like waiting and trying to pull the dog in but you manage to get the dog to a to a sit position and then the dog stays in the correct manner and he waits correctly on you and then when you pick him up the pickup is correctly done as well so a satisfactory exercise the down with recall same starting picture again um, then we see that uh, the dog goes down uh, we would like to see that a bit directed but the dog goes down in the right manner then on the recall the dog comes we would like to see a bit more spirit as well yep. a bit faster and then you, the dog comes in the right position gives you a little bump and then uh, when you do the finish you give a little bit of handler help um, so to see if you can pick that up in the future as well but a satisfactory exercise then we go to the long down under distraction um, the basic position was taken for good you took the lead off that's all good and then you needed two commands for the down yep. And then what you did, because you, you needed to command, you also set the stay command. Yep. So that's also an extra command. So try to stick to one command, okay. or if he comes up, say a second command, but don't do yeah. down plus stay. Okay. Yeah, because then we have to deduct you. Okay. Um, so I had to take a little couple of points of that. And then with the pick up, you also needed two commands to sit up. Yep. Yeah. So the down stay is not just a, uh, a down stay exercise, but it's a complete obedience exercise with good obedience beforehand and good obedience to finish it off, yeah? 
um, but today is satisfactory exercise so today you heard me say it was all satisfactory and uh, this score is a satisfactory score and you can go on to the track again thank you well done Woo! Well done.